Your house witnesses some evolutions and memorable moments in your life. Like your life, it needs some improvements and refreshments. Speaking of them, it might frighten us with a wide range of scary price tags, but getting interior enhancements doesn't have to break the bank if you know how to handle them. The key is focusing on small changes that will have a significant impact. If possible, you should also do it yourself to save money from hiring men or buying brand new furniture. Get your dream house with these 12 cheap interior improvement ideas. As always, Simp Home presents you with the list. Number 12. Stencil your floor. Give your outdated floors an improvement by painting and stenciling the ceramic tile for less than $75. Prepare and clean it by sanding, sweeping, and vacuuming. Apply a water-based primer twice, followed by a first coat of water-based semi-gloss exterior paint. Next, lay down a stencil onto the tile and paint it with a contrasting shade, then seal it with two coats of satin Minwax Polycrylic. Number 11. The DIY Mudroom Home Office Makeover Project Do not let an awkward spot in your house remain unused. You can build this DIY mudroom to make the space look more attractive and functional. To simplify, cut plywood to length, sand, assemble the cubby system, add supports, and drill into studs. Create a giant 8-foot tall box for the cabinet, add a divider, and drill holes for shelf pins. Add a floating bench by screwing 2x4s to studs. Number 10. Create an accent wall for less than $100. The accented wall is a great focal point in any room because it's timeless and simple. You can get the stylish featured wall for less than $100. After designing your project, prepare the walls by painting them and patching any holes or imperfections. Then, cut the trim moldings to size. You can use a 45-degree miter cut for the perfect angle. Now, it's time to attach them to the wall. Starting from one bottom corner with the help of wood spacers, nail the vertical and the horizontal piece to make an L shape. From this, you can easily create one trim box and then do the remaining. Number 9. A Concrete Wood Geometric Coffee Table Project Idea this fantastic coffee table is made from concrete and wood geometry as the base. To save money, use reclaimed lumbers and mill them to 2 and 3 quarter inches square. After that, cut the wood to approximate sizes. Lay all the pieces out and ensure everything will go together as you go. Glue and clamp everything in place before assembling the table. Then, smooth all the rough surfaces and stain them if you like. Attach the concrete top. In addition, to protect the floor, you can add some sort of slider feet to the bottom. Number 8. The Owen Reading Hub Idea by The Owen Chronicles Improve your living space by organizing things better. From the project, for example, you can build a new bookshelf by cutting plywood or pine board to length and creating the frame. Laminate the sides and shelves and attach the front pieces for a more finished look. Add spice racks to both sides of the bookshelf to optimize storage. Get 1 inch by 3 inch by 8 foot wood, 3 quarter inch by 2 and a half inch, cut into 3 pieces. Adjust the length to fit with the sides of the shelf and get a wooden dowel or furring strip. Assemble the pieces and screw the rack to the side. Number 7. A DIY Fluted Nightstand Idea Try this DIY nightstand using a wire spool and some wooden dowels for your bedroom. First, measure your spool height to ensure it would fit all the way around and cut the 3 quarter inch dowels. For the 20 inch spool, you'll need between 75 to 100 cut dowels. After sanding both ends of all the dowels, insert and nail them to the spool one by one. It'll be easier if you flip the spool on its side and work from top and bottom to the way around. Then cut out plywood into circular and nail it onto the top of the spool for a smooth finished top. Later, add four feet to add some height to the nightstand. In the end, stain it with the color you want. Number 6. The DIY Anthropology Primrose Inspired Mirror from an Old Bathroom Mirror by Lauren Jameson Add a mirror to a small room to make the space seem larger and airier. The first step is to assemble picture frame molding using glue and staples. Next, attach the mirror using liquid nails and metal clips. Fill the gaps and sand the corners. Stain the frame and attach appliques using glue and liquid nails. Number 5. An awesome multifunctional shoe cabinet for the hall by Tanya Van Hood Dalem. They are some sort of art that happens to be functional too. Before making these cabinets, you need to determine the composition you want. Depending on the space available and the style you adore, they can be lower or higher. Once you know what you want, get some 18mm MDF and cut it to length. Then, assemble them to create some boxes. You may want to root a groove in some bottom and top pieces. It will allow the 4mm door to fit so it can slide easily. 
You'll also need to install a wooden dowel inside some cabinets. Consider screwing some tiny dowels on the side of a cabinet to create more storage for keys. Number 4. A DIY sofa table with a paid plan you can easily follow by Pine & Poplar. Transform your living room by building a custom table to conceal the back of your sofa. The table will provide a surface for a vase and ample storage to organize your living room better. Start by cutting plywood pieces, applying edge banding, sanding, and staining all pieces including legs and dowels. Assemble the legs and side pieces, attach the back, bottom, and front parts, create the drawer box, and install the drawer slides. Finally, attach the dowels, trim, and top to finish the look. For the measurement, you can find the details on Simphome. Number 3. A DIY Minimalist Wooden Sofa Idea by Hedwig at NoFruit.nl Transform your living room with a sleek and functional sofa that doubles as a side table. Best of all, you can easily make it yourself at home. Start by gathering a 150cm long and 3.5cm diameter wooden handle and cutting it into 6 15cm legs. Measure 10cm from each corner of the seat board and mark the spot, then attach the legs there and in the middle. For a smooth finish, attach the armrests using 6mm dowels instead of screws. Pre-drill two holes, slide the pieces together, and screw the armrest to the seat and backrest. Complete the look by adding cushions and pillows to give a new look to your living room. Number 2. A tightly curved stair retouch that can be your savior one time. Transform your stairs with a fresh new look using this simple DIY idea. Use modeling tape to create your desired shape on each step. Transfer it to the corresponding stair, cut it down to size, and install it for a sleek finish. Add a semi-gloss lacquer finish to the sides for an anti-slip illusion and protect your oak steps with a suitable lacquer or paint. Give your staircase a new look in a short time. Before we complete the countdown with our final choice of the current list, we'd like to inform you that if you need other improvement ideas, you have Simphome Content Collections on your side. There, we cover other interesting topics such as garden, home improvement, finance, bathroom upgrade, bedroom update ideas, and many more. We'll see you there, and until we meet again sometime in the future, let's close our countdown with number one, the Ombre Shower Tile Project Idea. Transform your bathroom tile from drab to fab for just $60. Start by prepping the tile with caulking removal, washing, sanding, and a bonding primer. Use oil-based enamel paint for a bold ombre pink effect. Create the ombre look by gradually adding water to the paint for each row, starting with the darkest shade on the bottom and working your way up to a paler pink. Allow a week for the paint to dry before using the bathroom. That's it for now. Before you leave this presentation, we'd like to appreciate every second you spend watching the video. If we deserve more of your attention in the future, press the subscribe button if you haven't done it already. Like the video if you believe it will motivate the YouTube algorithm to push the video to more people. Honestly though, it's more like a myth to us, so feel free to move on with your plan after the video ends. Lastly, we hope you have great luck with your health and project. See you again soon.